Tegan. Good win at the weekend and uh, quite a, a momentous occasion for yourself. Yeah, it um, definitely was a great game and um, obviously not used to scoring. So, uh, yeah, that was quite special and um, also a great achievement from the team as well. So, yeah, still on a high. I can't imagine had you scored six before in a game. I mean, putting juniors maybe <laughs> aside, but certainly at a senior level. Look, I, I wish I could say yes, I do it all the time, but uh, definitely not. Um, obviously, been playing a full back role as well. Uh, definitely not my main priority uh, to score. So um, jumping into that 11 role um, has been challenging, but fun at the same time. And it's um, rewarding to finally get some goals in the back of the net. What went, went through your mind? Obviously, you got the third. Uh, you went close with the header as well <laughs> to, to actually almost get the third one. What did you mind when you suddenly got the fourth and get the fifth? What was going through your mind at that point? Yeah, look, honestly, um, the last couple of weeks I've been playing 11. I think, you know, it's probably been my third game or fourth game now um, that I've been chucked into that role. So um, I have had opportunities to score in previous weeks, but um, unfortunately it wasn't happening for me. Um, I was hitting the post or I was striking through the ball rather than placing the ball. Um, and I think that, you know, something that really helped me on the weekend was just not thinking too much about it and just doing what comes natural and just, yeah, placing it in the back of the net. So, um, yeah, honestly, not too much was going through my head. I was just, you know, um, appreciating the moment and soaking it all in. You did mention uh, hitting the post previously. It was perhaps a little bit ironic that you actually got two of those goals came off the post. <laughs> yeah. the so I thought it was that something for, oh, about time. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Um, it was something where I kind of double checked to make sure that it had went in and um, yeah, big relief when it actually had went in. So, yeah. That's a little bit funny as well that it was up against Isabella, who obviously was a former teammate. Yeah. Is that something you thought about much during the game? Uh, no, not really. Um, it's funny though because she did mention to me after the game that, you know, it was her birthday and that I had kindly gifted her six birthday presents. So um, she had a good laugh about it. And, you know, we, um, funny enough, actually celebrated together afterwards. So she's an awesome keeper and also a good sport as well. So, yeah. We've seen the, uh, the aeroplane celebration a couple of times. Where did it come from? Uh, honestly, Juddy, I don't know. Um, as I said, I don't score that often. So when I do, I definitely make the most of it. and. The plane just comes natural to me, so it's, yeah, my go-to. And it's probably quite fortunate because last year you tried it and we had a bit of a plane crash. <laughs> yeah. Um, no, I made sure to land this one this time, so pretty proud of that. <laughs> You've got the Super Women's Kappa Super Cup tomorrow against Olympic, um, and you then also face them again at the weekend. What's your thoughts leading into that one? Yeah, look, um, at the moment I know that a few of the girls are having a few injuries, um, we've always obviously still got Cannon overseas, uh, we're missing her on the pitch, um, as well as Beck. she's out with a foot injury and uh, we're hoping that she's back sooner rather than later. Um, although Amy is still playing at the moment, I know that she's got a few uh, niggles at the moment that she's hopefully mending from. Um, so, and obviously, you know, um, Chels herself, she's made some pretty big achievements as well. So. Um, I feel like we say this week in, week out that we've got a few players out, <laughs> that we've got a few players out, um, but it seems to be the case again. However, um, as Rob always says, that we do have um, a great depth within our squad and um, we're fortunate enough that, um, you know, if we play to the best of our ability, we do um, have the players to take on those roles and... Um, Definitely, you know, Olympic are a strong team and they've always got a, a point to prove. So I know that they'll come out quite physical and um, I know that they'll be quite aggressive. So it's something that we'll definitely prepare for and hopefully we can get the three points and move forward uh, in that cup. Thanks, so. well, best of luck with that. And uh, let's hope Tegan Thompson Airways gets to take off again tomorrow night and uh, you've been cropping up, certainly the weekend, you popped up in the right place at the right time each time. So. Congratulations on that and uh, we look forward to uh, seeing you next time. Thanks, Daddy. Cheers. Cheers.